Hey guys, we made it onto the ship uh, last night around seven o'clock, and uh, we stayed the night here. And then uh, we'll be we've been here all day today. It's getting uh, in the afternoon now. We'll stay the night again on the ship, and we'll arrive in Makassar sometime uh, tomorrow morning, ish, in between five and seven a.m. And so this is the area outside of the ship here and where Julie slept last night and I slept today. This is um, Landun and Ajeng. What I thought we'd do is we'd go ahead and start our tour by going inside and looking around in there first. So let's go ahead and go on inside the ship. Wow. Here's an area right here where you can buy snacks and different things like that. Sleeping area, although not really designated for sleeping, but a lot of people sleep here. Let's go down and look at where we were allowed to worship today. We uh, talked to the ship information booth and they gave us permission to worship down here in the barber shop. So let's go down here. Oh, we have to be quiet though, because people are sleeping. Hello. 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 video, Hello. 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 Yeah. Hello. 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 Papua. These yes. are our friends from Papua. And they uh, worshipped with us this morning. But here's where we worshipped. You see here? Tadi. Yes. Yeah, so we worshipped in there this morning. But it's closed now. Okay, so that's where we had worship. And uh, down here is where Landung and his family staying. Hello, Landung. Hello. This is the uh, one of the driver's rooms where they get to sleep. So let's cruise down here. Ah, bloom. Oh, here's some food. Wow, Seth, you need a fried chicken head? No. You don't want a fried chicken head? No. Or a, whatever that thing is? It's got mold growing on it. That's gross. I don't think that's intended to be eaten. All right, let's cruise down over here. We'll go downstairs and uh, look at, they have this place where they sell fried goodies. We've got uh, chicken and fried mushrooms and I sell fried potatoes that are actually pretty good. We got some today that were only two hours old and uh, they were tasty. This is the entertainment room where a lot of people are camping out and uh, not really using it for its intended purpose, but that's okay. It's supposed to come in here to watch movies and, and hang out, but people have set up camp there. All right, let's go, uh, we'll go back outside and check out the rest of the outside of the ship. Let's see, to the front here where we can't go, check out this side of the ship. Let's go down here to where the cars are and uh, we'll see kind of that parking area and we'll see some of the chickens that they have down here. More people camping out and all of the cars here. There's a Toyota Hilux, pretty cool car. Very similar, I guess, to our Toyota Tacomas. All right, let's, uh, let's squeeze through all the cars here. Here's uh, how you can get down to the lower deck by car, but I think it's closed. Yeah, see they have it closed off somehow. It's like a, I don't know how it works, but I'd like to know because I'd like to go down there. But I haven't figured out how to do that yet. All right, so we're cruising down here to the lowest part of the outside of the ship that I found we can get to, where we have the winches for the ropes. I mean, look at the, look at the size of the rope here. And that's, that's a pretty big rope. 
the rope to uh, hold the ship to the pier. We got back here. And then, of course, you can see, hey Seth, be careful, please, be careful. Then you can see the back of the boat here. Check out this cool thing, Seth. That's awesome, huh? Yeah, that's to throw the uh, to throw this to the pier so that they can catch it, and then this is attached. To that rope then is attached to the big rope so they can they can pull it in. You can just go up right there. All right, guys. So from this spot, all right, we came up one level. Here's where we were down below, and uh, now we're on the next level up. And so you can see here, you've got uh, this level where the cars are. The next level, there's like a canteen in the back. And then above that is uh, kind of an observation deck and also the prayer room for the Muslims. So let's go ahead and, and we'll walk up there and let you see that as well. Here's the canteen area. You can buy uh, <coughs> snack food. Hello. Snack food and different types of food. Drinks, watch TV. Got some birds hanging up here. What kind of birds we got here? If you know what kind of birds these are, go ahead and leave it in the comments. Because I have no idea. Maybe some of you guys are bird watchers out there. Okay, so that's the canteen area. Let's cruise up one more level to the observation area and where the prayer room is. It gets a little bit more noisy and windy up here. There's a, there's a smell of exhaust up here because you have the exhaust pipes right, right up there and the exhaust from the engine room itself coming out so you can feel gusts of warm air and a smell of diesel fuel up here but it's still pretty cool so this is what we've got here here you've got uh, a view of the drawbridge or the draw gate or whatever you call that thing right there where you can drive the vehicles in and then you have the uh, ropes again on the other side of the ship where hold it to the pier. Okay, so let's go ahead and cruise over here. Like I said, this is the prayer room. Whoa. And we'll go back down this way, which is where Mark and I slept. Was right down here, you see this long hallway right here. Surprisingly, it got, ooh, it got cold and uh, I was freezing. So yeah, but that's okay. So that's being a peeping Tom in the windows. Were you being a peeping Tom in the windows? What? Were you being a peeping Tom in the windows? I don't think they want, hey Seth, come on. I don't think they want you looking in their windows, dude. Right here in this aisle way is where Mark and I slept. We slept right about, yeah, right about here where I'm standing. Just put down some mats on the floor here and had a little blanket thing and uh, slept right here. Jules and the kids slept downstairs where I showed you earlier. And like I said, uh, Landung and his wife slept inside in a hallway. And this is the special area that we're not allowed into because it's locked, but it would be really cool to get up to the front of the ship up there. But unfortunately, yeah, it's not for us. This is the side of the ship in the front here. Woo. Where it's windy, windy. So let's go back down where we started our tour from. And here we are. Back where we started. That is a tour of the ship that we are on for about 32 hours. Hope you enjoyed it. Say hi to the folks back home. Hi. hi. Everybody says hi. Talk to you later. Bye.